It was a Swiss doctor who first suggested that giant plastic balls could be used for health purposes, and Swiss balls, as they became known, soon became very popular. Many people believe that sitting on a Swiss ball is an effective way of building your muscles. These days, you'll see them used for general fitness training when you go to a gym. The Japanese tea ceremony is a tour influenced by Buddhism in which green tea is prepared and served to a small group of guests in a peaceful setting. The ceremony can take as long as four hours and there are many traditional gestures that both the server and the guest must perform. It has long been possible to modify the appearance of the precious metals such as gold by adding a layer of another material, such as an alloy. For example, variation is made, what is known as rose gold by adding copper. Nanotechnology department at Monash University have discovered the way to produce gold and silver simply by making microscopic alterations in the surface that affect the way the material reflects light.
Major breeding areas and breeding islands are shown as dark green areas or darts. Open darts show no breeding records on islands and are also used for offshore sightings, that is from ships or boats. Other areas where species is not meant to be seen are plain pale green, with pale green hatching where records are usually sparse. Poor communication practices within a company can lead to personal conflicts and unsatisfactory work, as well as an incorrect understanding of the business's goals. All of these factors can make staff unhappy and may even make them decide to leave their job. On the other hand, effective communication means there is trust between members of staff, which helps the company produce more and perform at its best. Like coffee, plain tea contains just a couple of calories per cup and no sugar. But what's added in it can change that situation. A medium sweet tea and a large iced latte from fast food restaurants both pack about 7 teaspoons of sugar. However, the American Heart Association recommends no more than 6 teaspoons for the whole day.
The primary application we're targeting at first is to give people a decision aid during rehabilitation, following an acute knee injury, to help them understand when they can perform particular activities, and when they can move to different intensities of particular activities. A useful thing to take crack at. Foam-filled furniture is very dangerous if it catches fire, and foam quickly produces a high temperature, thick smoke and poisonous gases, including carbon monoxide. Therefore, set levels of fire resistance have been established for new and secondhand upholstered furniture and other similar products. Scientists can quantify haze, but opinions on other types of visual pollution are mixed. Billboards, power lines, cell phone towers, and even modern skyscrapers may elicit a variety of emotions. A billboard in a favorable location may be attractive to a business person. However, it is visual pollution to the tourist who wants to see the hills or the lovely town behind that advertisement.
The third revolution the travel industry has experienced in the past 50 years is being brought on by the growth of developing economies. The first one appeared in the 1960s in the form of package trips and inexpensive air travel. People with limited resources were able to travel more, to more distant locations, and to take advantage of, all in deals, that may have included camel rides, scuba diving, or sightseeing excursions. Breathing fresh air is as crucial to your body as regular exercise. Wherever you live, wherever you work or study in, there should always be some free time to rest under a tree or a garden for a few minutes. However, a good air quality should also be followed by a deep breath. This way, inhaling and exhaling can actually feed your cells and lungs with oxygen while refreshing your mind and body. For any marketing course that requires the development of marketing plans, such as marketing management, marketing strategy, and segmentation support marketing, this is the only planning handbook that guides students through the step-by-step -step creation of customized marketing plan, while offering commercial software to aid in the process.
The Challenger games are designed to help people to be active and get fit. In particular, they were invented to encourage older men and women to get more exercise and to give them a chance to meet other people. Regular physical activity helps to maintain energy, strength, and flexibility. You can start gently and do a little more each session. Imagine living all your life as the only family on your street. Then, one morning, you open the front door and discover houses all around you. You see neighbors tending their gardens and children walking to school. Where did all the people come from? What if the answer turned out to be that they had always been there you just hadn't seen them? Despite being ranked fifth of all countries in the world for language diversity, the United States tends to focus heavily on English in schools, with the native languages of students often going unrecognized. Educator Megan Alyabiki Flick advocates for dual language programs.
Researchers have found that divorce has different kinds of negative impacts on the planet, including higher demand for resources and a lower rate of efficiency in the use of household resources. People have been talking about how to protect the environment and combat climate change, but divorce is an overlooked factor that needs to be considered. Homeopathy is a medical field that believes the body recovers itself due to its rejuvenating powers. Homeopathic doctors focus on curing the patient by finding the root cause of illness and disease. It's been a week since a massive 7.8 magnitude earthquake rocked Turkey and Syria, claiming the lives of more than 36,000 people. Many tens of thousands more have been injured. Millions may be left homeless. Few images have captured the devastation of the past week as starkly as a photograph of Masoud Hanser.
This term the university is running a series of workshops for final year students on how to do well in interviews. These sessions will help participants prepare effectively for and perform at their best during later job interviews. The workshop tutors have an excellent record of success in helping students acquire the positions they desire. The executive residence in the White House in the United States of America, where the president resides, is divided into several wings. It also includes the vice president's and president's staff's offices. This government building is a national heritage.